Alright guys, let's play a 2D platforming game called Hexagon, once again made by Epic Games. And I used to play this a lot back in the day. Um, this was released back in 93, I think. And it's a pretty good platforming game. I think it beat the Shero version, actually. Yeah. See this story right here. Kind of an explorer type of guy. Archaeologist. But what they didn't tell you is that he's an archaeologist that could fire lasers from his uh, from his waist. So that's something they didn't tell you there. <laughs> okay, anyways, let's play a game. Okay, so you have this little overhead map here, which is pretty cool. You have journal entries you can read. It's the first level. Malvinus. About Malvinus is the name of this guy's name. Interesting name. Okay. Yeah, this is a pretty interesting platforming game. Uh, from, with some pretty interesting monsters, uh, power ups. Got some. Ooh, extra laser bullet. Cool. Have anything here? Nope. Emeralds. I can use to buy items. I can use it to buy healthy net, extra laser, rapid fire, one fireball, five, fire, five fireballs, or invincible. And some other uh, power ups you can use. Ooh. Okay, I only have five units of health, so if I'm not. Okay, gift boxes. Ooh, fruit. Let's give me health. I played this around the same time as that that other epic game, uh, Jill of the Jungle. So this one and Jill of the Jungle I played with a lot when I was I was a kid. But yeah, it's pretty good. Sound effects are good. Gameplay is pretty good. Um, Music is pretty good as well. Hmm, rocks, laser bullets, fireballs, those are my three weapons I can get in this game. Save. Journal, journal entry. You need keys to unlock these gates. Which you have to find in the other levels. Ooh, rapid fire. Awesome. Giant bumblebee. And centipedes, too. Wow. I need a key. Oops.
Oh shit. Oh, I collected centipedes, okay. Alright, there we go. Go to that one, or I can go to this one. Try this one. Oh man. Try again. Okay, so this case for opening the gate on the map, the over the overworld map. Not the not this level. Sound effects are funny. Oh. Ooh, shoes, that's what I need. These shoes. Ah, oh, so hard to hit those little fish. Super shoes, super jumping shoes.
open. Now I can open that gate. That key is actually so that key of God is actually for this map overhead view. Yep, so I can open that gate here. I need another one, so I presumably get it from the other level. But uh, yeah, I just want to show you guys a bit of uh, what Exagon is like. This sounds interesting, Robot de Development Planet. Oh, let me just finish this one then. Robots. Ooh, fireball, nice. Shoot a fireball. One hit. Oh. I have no way to get up there. Oh, I do. Elevator thing. Sword. Saber. It's one of the objects I get from my archaeological discoveries, I'm guessing. Extra laser bullet. Alright, there we go. So yeah. And let's just open that last gate. Anyways, you guys get the idea. This is Exagon from 1993, made by, um, well, distributed by Epic Games, and uh, pretty good platforming action here. Uh, it's one of my favorite games when I was young, so I played it a lot, a lot, a fair bit, along with many Apogee games and stuff, and Sierra games, so. Yeah, it's a great, great platforming action here. Oh man, okay. Okay, I'm just gonna stop it here. <laughs> Oops, I gotta save from the map board. You're gonna throw rocks. Ooh. Alright. Yep, that's it. Um, I have in granny mode, what's that? Can have additional inventory, yep. Buy extra items. Okay, and that is Exagon. Thanks for watching.